Hey there. I'm looking forward to sharing today's named reaction presentation. Today, we're going to look at the Friedel Crafts reaction. First, a few facts. This reaction is categorized as an acylation and alkylation of aromatic compounds, and it follows the electrophilic substitution mechanism. It was discovered in 1877 by French chemist Charles Friedel and American chemist James Crafts, and has been a staple of organic synthesis ever since. So let's take a look at the reaction process. The product of the reaction is the alkyl or acyl functionalized aromatic compound. The starting point of the reaction is always an aromatic ring, a simple benzene or more complex heterocycle. The functionalization of the ring can affect the final product, with electron withdrawal groups, such as hydroxyl or amino groups, having an orto-para orientation effect, whilst electron donating groups, such as nitro or sulfonyl groups, favor the reaction of the metaposition. The reaction can proceed with an alkyl halide or an acyl halide. It works in the same way, but the reaction product is obviously different. A Lewis acid catalyst is necessary to activate the halide reagent. This is typically aluminum chloride or ferric chloride. Other metal halides can be used, but are less common. The product of the reaction is the alkyl or acyl functionalized aromatic compound. They are formed with relatively fast kinetics in solvent-free systems, or hydrophobic solvents and moderate heat. It's a very well-known reaction, easily scalable, and widely utilized in organic synthesis for thousands of different products. There are not many alternatives to functionalized aromatic compounds. So despite being over 140 years old, this reaction continues to play a key role in organic synthesis. A notable example of its application is the preparation of cosylene analogs, which are being investigated for their anti-HIV properties. Thermo Fisher Scientific offers a wide range of chemical products, including all of those used in this reaction, some of which you can see here. To find out more about this reaction and our chemical products and services that can help you, visit the Named Reactions page today.